Hello everybody. Today we are going to use a couple of balloons to make a hat of the dog. Then we can attach it to different bodies or balloon hats. Inflate a balloon leaving about 5 inch flat tail. Twist the first soft about 1 inch long bubble. Lock both ends of the first bubble in one lock twist. We have made a nose. This sculpture is actually a variation of another uh, dog hat that we made recently. Twist the second about 3 inch long bubble. Then we twist the third the same about 3 inch long bubble. Lock both ends of the chain of the last two bubbles in one lock twist. Now we have to twist the fourth the same size about 3 inch long bubble. We have to lock the free end of the fourth bubble between the second and the third bubbles. The same way as we usually make the bird body twist. Roll the second and the third bubbles around the fourth bubble. Alright, we have made the bird body twist. The next two bubbles we twist to make the cheeks. Let's twist the fifth soft about 5 inch long bubble. Then we twist the sixth, the same size soft about 5 inch long bubble. Lock all ends of the last two bubbles in one lock twist. We have made the muzzle kind of chubby. Here's a front view. The next bubble we're going to twist to make the eye. Let's twist the seventh about 3 inch long bubble. Then we twist the eighth soft about 1 inch long bubble. We need the eighth bubble to hold the ears in the proper positions. Lock both ends of the eighth bubble in one lock twist. Now we have to twist the ninth, about 3 inch long bubble, same size as we did uh, the seventh bubble. Lock both ends of the chain of the last three bubbles in one lock twist. The rest of the balloon is a tenth bubble that will represent the neck. Ok, we have made the head, here's a front view, the side view, the back view. In this example I'm going to use blue color balloon to make the ears. We can make them in different shapes. Inflate a balloon leaving about 6 inch flat tail. Let's twist the first about 6 inch long bubble. Lock both ends of the first blue bubble in one lock twist. Now we have to twist the second about 1 inch long bubble. Lock both ends of the second blue bubble in one lock twist. Twist the third about 1 inch long bubble. We have made the first ear. Now we can lock the free end of the third blue bubble with the eighth red bubble of the head. Keep working to make the second ear. Twist the fourth blue about 1 inch long bubble. Twist the fifth soft about 1 inch long blue bubble. Lock both ends of the fifth blue bubble in one lock twist. And now we have to twist the sixth blue about 6 inch long bubble. Try to make it the same as we made the first blue bubble. Lock both ends of the sixth blue bubble in one lock twist. We have made the second ear. Let's cut off the rest of the blue balloon. Tie off the end. You can trim the end of the blue balloon with scissors or just hide it between blue bubbles. Let's fix all bubbles in proper positions. Congratulations, we have made the dog head. Here's a front view, the side view, the back view. We can draw the face of the dog uh, using permanent black marker. Draw eyes, briskest nose, 
Actually we can use a different color balloon to make the nose bubble. Same way as we did the ears using different color balloon. Well I'm just going to draw the nose with a marker. Some heart shape. As I mentioned before we can attach the dog head to different bodies or to heads. Let's twist about 3 inch long bubble at uh, the end of the neck bubble. I have in advance prepared the body for this sculpture. So now I'm just going to attach the free end of the neck bubble between blue bubbles of the body and legs. And then we can lock both ends of the last red bubble in one lock twist. This way it will look better. Last time let's fix all bubbles in proper positions. Congratulations again! We have made the sculpture of dog. On my website fidui.com you may find links to many instructions how to make different heads and bodies. Have fun and happy twisting!